Adventures in Pixie Land presents your daily energy reading. Your daily astrology reading for August 16th, 2024 is action taker Mars in outgoing Gemini square. It's no good. Strict Saturn retrograde in dreamy Pisces. So this is not a day when work will be something that motivates you. Uh, take lots of breaks to try to make it through the day. Your Elder Futhark Daily Rune for August 16th, 2024 is Fehu. Fehu, the letter F, meaning cattle or wealth. Associations are wealth, success, abundance, increased income, possession, happiness, financial gain. Today, your focus is on gaining financial abundance. You may be concentrating your efforts on labors that bring in money. Your daily romance angel oracle card for August 16th, 2024 is keep an open mind. Keep an open mind. The meaning? The romance angels sent you this card as a reminder to stay open to the possibilities of your soulmate appearing in a form that may differ from what you expect. This is especially true if you tend to date a certain quote unquote type of individual. This card was drawn to help you discover your soulmate. This card may sing signal that you have already been introduced to this person, but have overlooked his or her or their romantic potential. Take the time to get to know the various individuals you meet, even if there isn't an initial attraction. At the very least, you will learn more about yourself and may make a new friend. Your daily fairy wisdom oracle card for August 16th, 2024 is Painting Poppies. Card 49, Painting Poppies. Creativity, paint a poppy today. Creativity can be as simple as painting poppies. These fairies love what they're doing. Every person has a special area in their life where they shine. It is up to you to find your gift unconsciously nurture it. If you truly love what you're doing, you cannot help but be successful. Don't allow others to tell you your dream is impossible. If there is something that you love doing, go for it. Ask the fairies to help you connect to the universal creative energies and to focus them on your work. If you choose this card, you may be searching for that special gift you still have to find, but never fear, you will find it. Or you may know your gift, but be hesitant about putting in the effort to develop it. In that case, this card is telling you to get on with it. Quit wasting time. Some gifts are more tangible than others. You can see a painting or hear a person playing music, but other gifts come in more subtle ways. Be willing to explore and find out what your gift is. When you find it, you will love it. And so you will know it's yours. It is a time to embrace your confidence and determination. Effort reaps reward. Chant. I feel the creative force moving through my body. I feel the yen for something more. My gifts emerge within my being. I employ them to the best of my ability for the light and joy of all. So be it. Your daily star seed oracle card for August 16th, 2024 is lost lands lost lands soul memories and gifts you've done this before this world is far more ancient than our documented history suggests as souls many of us have experienced ancient eras on this planet that were much more advanced than ours today 
As we begin to remember these times, the remembering and the gifts can come flooding back. At this stage in the Earth timeline, we need the wisdom of the ancients to survive as a species. You're being called to connect with the lost wisdom of your own soul. If you feel guided to make a change in your life, to step into a new career path, birth a creation, or bring an idea to life, but feel unprepared, this card is telling you to consider that you've done this before. Perhaps your soul has wisdom beyond what your lifespan can imagine. Perhaps the intuitive hits and ideas you're receiving are divinely guided. Perhaps you've been preparing for this time. Some think that lost lands exist in the past. Others believe they exist today in different dimensions. I believe these ancient lands also exist in the souls of those who've experienced them. If this card comes to you, perhaps the wisdom of the lost lands such as Lermia, Atlantis, or Avalon exists within you. And through surrendering to the intelligence of your soul, you can unlock the seeds of these ancient lands so we can all learn from our mistakes and usher in a new age. Your star seed activation. Place your hand over the portal of your heart and whisper the following. I unlock any forgotten wisdom and soul gifts from lifetimes past. Your Daily Priestess of Light Oracle card for August 16th, 2024 is Summoning Power. Summoning Power. Instinct. Intellect. Control. This Priestess of the Night is summoning the power of the full moon and channeling the wild wolves behind her. She is calm and in control. The wolves stand at attention with the energy of quiet strength resonating from above. This card is telling you that you have far more powers than you realize. There may be something in your life, perhaps a relationship or a re recent challenge that you have felt powerless to handle. If so, it is time to focus on your own intellect and instinct on the issue at hand then muster the courage to take the necessary action. It may also be a time to harness the unhealthy personal patterns that you have left unchecked. Indulgences and addictions might seem to have had an upper hand, but your wild impulses can absolutely be tamed. Remain peaceful, but persistent in this noble pursuit of self-honoring and self-control. Be honest about your ability to prioritize your higher needs. When you summon the quiet yet powerful light of your soul, your intuitive strength becomes the central force in your own life and a resonant voice in the world. Your affirmation, I am strong and self-directed. I bring my inner power to every area of my life. Your daily energy reading for August 16th, 2024 is the astrology is telling you that it's just one of those days where you lay in bed and contemplate calling out of work. Faye who says you have your mind on your money and your money on your mind. The romance oracle reminds you to pause and think before you react. The fairies remind you to nurture your creative talents. The starseed oracle reminds you that you instinctually have access to the information you need when you need it. It's called trust your gut. The priestess of light oracle reminds you that as an adult, you do actually have the ability to change your environment. Now you might be trying to decide whether or not you feel 
like applying your creative efforts to whatever it is in your environment that you don't want to go do is actually worth your time and energy. And that's a good and valid thing to contemplate. But don't go all crazy and do something rash. We're not supposed to react. Reaction is for, you know, catching babies or slamming on brakes or anything where that knee-jerk instantaneous response is precisely what saves something or someone from getting injured or broken or however that plays out. The only time you really listen to that is if you're in such a deep-rooted fear that you feel instinctually everything about this is wrong. Listen to that. Is your gut telling you you're in danger? Now, if you're not feeling that deep-rooted fear, and it's not down on that core level where every part of you is you know, terrified of this next moment and this next step, then you likely don't need to react. You need to pause Maybe use your creativity or your expressive outlets to help you calm. Maybe you need to express it to somebody around you. You need to speak to whoever you instinctually feel like you need to speak to. Because there's something with work, something with your creative talent, something with money, something in the practical, real 3D world that you need to apply your creative talents to if you're going to change your environment. You know what you need to do. So make whatever arrangements you need to make so you can get done what you need doing.